guys, we're on our way to the Mount McKeeling Forest Reserve. This is the 33rd ASEAN Heritage Park located here in the Philippines. So we're not here just to hike, but we are here to look for the Rafflesia, a rare and endangered species and one of the biggest flower here. So come on and let's look for this awesome flower. So we're currently here at Station 11. So we have here our colleagues from the ASEAN Center for Biodiversity and all of us will be looking and searching for the Rafflesia plant. So let's go and have fun. All right, so this, this place is very popular with hikers, usually on a weekend or during um, Holy Week. So you see a lot of people here climb up. So two more stations until we reach uh, station 14 where the um, Rafflesia is currently located. So it said from station 11 to station 14 is roughly around 30 minutes hike. So let's go check it out. We are here at station 13. So when we're one more station away to seeing the Rafflesia flowers. All right, I think we're really close. So they said the flower smells really bad because it releases um, an odor to attract insects and other flies so that they can pollinate this flower. I can smell it from here, but seriously, just kidding. But we're really close right now. We're taking a break from the hike, so it's a tiring hike right now. So we got our colleagues here from ACB. So we're making our way, we're almost there. <laughs> Alright, so we found it. You found the wall clap. We found a watch, so not the Rafflesia. <laughs> so we are here at station 14. So now we're going to look for that flower and hopefully it's here. A few moments later. We found some rotten ones. So too bad we didn't really see any. So it's just such a waste coming up here. Just kidding. We actually found one over right here. So, and it's bloomed really well, but it's about to go rotten anytime soon. The Rafflesia plant or flower is a parasitic plant without any leaves or stems and roots. So basically it absorbs nutrients from its host, kind of like this tree here. So we're here with our local guide. We are Henry, right? Morning. A couple of buds here surrounding the only Rafflesia that has bloomed. So the guy said that they only bloom during midnight or sometimes during the day. So you could have, you could also wait for it when it blooms. Now I'm gonna spell flower to see what it really smells like. So it smells like rotten egg or a, a dried fish. Because we are here very in And you have a similar thing in Indonesia, yes, we have, but, but the bigger. bigger one. Oh, wow. All right. So they're all here looking at the flower. have a fly inside the Rafflesia. So like I mentioned earlier there, um, parasite that attracts flies. And don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell to get more updates from our next videos. And follow our social media sites to get updates from ACB.